What's going on YouTubers and this is the last game in the series of which game mode will get you to level 50 the fastest This is demolition. I do have two more games for you guys of domination. They'll be coming out soon I do have the stats for you. I had 3,186 kills 90 assists 96 plants 36 diffuses and the bonus XP was 192,384 I do like demolition uh, it's probably like my third or fourth favorite uh, game uh, game mode in uh, you know the COD franchise. Um, <laughs> it's very easy to spawn trap. Um, I actually only spawn trapped like one or two uh, games out of, the, out of all the demolition games I played. I don't like going in with a party um, more than three people just because I want to try and make it a little bit difficult for me to do good you know challenge myself every once in a while so I usually only play with one or two guys max um, so I want to talk to you guys tonight about times I just effed myself up or people effing me up and I'm not gonna tell you guys any fights or anything like that just times where I've been hurt really, really bad. Uh, so the first one I tell you want to tell you guys is it actually happened to me not too long ago. Um, I play in a football tournament every year, and what it is is all these colleges come around and they do um, uh, this big football tournament, and it's full on tackle, no pads or anything like that. So I'm playing in this tournament, and we're playing our rivals. And the dude that's, uh, I'm on the defensive line, so the dude I'm going against on the offensive line, he's about three, close to 300 pounds. He's, uh, he's perfectly sphere. He's very well-rounded, let's say, okay? So this one play, you know, the, the quarterback hikes the ball. I start running in. Dude pushes me back, and I slip, and I fall backwards right on my ass. So as I'm trying to get up, this guy decides it's a great idea to belly flop on me. So as I'm getting up, this 300-pound guy freaking belly flops right on top of me, and I hear my ankle crack or pop. I don't know which one it was, but it hurt really, really, really bad. So I tried playing a little bit later that day, and I, I couldn't do it. So instead of doing the smart thing, which would be to go to the hospital and get an x-ray, no, I decided not to do that and to this day I can still you know feel it and I can crack it um, so sooner or later I'll probably go and see if I have like a fracture or something like that but uh, for right now I'm, I'm old school I don't go to the doctor unless I'm dying okay uh, if I'm sick I don't I don't go to the doctor I pop some pills and I go to work or I stay home uh, you know if something really really like if I'm bleeding I'll go to the freaking doctor and I can't stop it myself. But besides that, I, I stay away from hospitals and doctors and, and whatnot. So the next one I want to tell you guys is... Uh, oh, what's the next one I want to tell you? Uh, okay, yeah. And please do not do this at home, all right? Yeah, I'm going to put one of those uh, freaking things out there for you. Please do not do this at home. Uh, this is back in high school. Me and my buddies decided to go buy some BB guns. And we didn't get the, the rifle-looking ones. No, we got the handguns with the, the CO2 cartridge and... Um, I think uh, they held like uh, 20, 20 BBs um, max, and so we decided to go um, with our great idea here to go play uh, BB gun wars or something like that. So it's one on one, and you know when you get shot, you're out of the game. So <sighs> we're playing. It's around midnight, you know, and we're playing in this playground. Uh, so I'm up on this, uh, bridge part where you can go slide down and stuff. And I'm, you know, dolphin diving, sliding all over the place. And yes, that's right. I was dolphin diving before there was dolphin diving. Um, and this dude has me pegged. I have no idea where he was, it was, but all I hear is like ping, 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 ping all around me. All right. This guy has me pinned down. So I run out of BBs and, you know, I stand up and go, all right, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Well, he decides to get l one last shot at me and nails me right above my lip. And, you know, if you've never been shot with a BB, it freaking hurts, okay? So I'm like, I'm done, I'm done. 
as we go back, you know, to go back into the car to, to check me out, and uh, my lip has swollen as big as the dude from uh, Forrest Gump. Bubba, his name, yeah. My lip is freaking huge now. So one of the guys uh, mentioned, he's like, hey, dude, I think uh, the BB's still lodged in there. So instead of going to the hospital like a smart person would do, no, I decide to see if I can pop it out myself. And lo and behold, the BB was still lodged in my lip. And I had to pop it, pop it out of myself. It bled for the next three days. That's how bad it was. Um, and to this day, I still got a scar. So the last one I'm going to tell you is when I was just being a complete idiot. Um, so it's back in high school again. Me and my buddy were riding bikes all over the place. And we went to Dunkin' Donuts and each picked up a dozen donuts for ourselves. So we're sitting um, at the post office eating these donuts uh, and we're sitting on the stairs and next to the stairs are two huge uh, like five foot high big cement blocks uh, right next to the stairs and my buddy bets me or he's like I'll, you know I'll give you a dollar if you uh, ride your bike off of there so I'm like all right no problem uh, I'll take your dollar so I get up on there and right before I'm gonna go I'm trying to psych myself up I'm like gosh you know fuck it what's the worst that can happen and I decide to go off. Well, my dumbass forgets to lift the handlebars up uh, right before I get off, and I just flip over. My head's freaking bl bloody. My ear, for some reason, was bleeding at the same time. Uh, so, yeah, don't even try that at home, all right, unless you know how to freaking bunny hop and stuff. So the video's over, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And until next time.